Evangelical Christian voters will have one of their last opportunities before the Iowa caucuses in January to get a look at the shrinking Republican field in Des Moines on Friday. Although former President Donald Trump is far ahead in polls and has kept the white evangelical base in check since 2016 general election, faith leaders say that base is still up for grabs. Influential evangelical leader Bob Vander Plot's organization, Family Leader, will host Florida Governor Ron DeSantis. Biotech entrepreneur Vivek Ramaswamy and former U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations Nikki Haley for a Thanksgiving family forum. Sen. Tim Scott of South Carolina and former Vice President Mike Pence withdrew from the primary in the past two weeks. Although Trump is a frontrunner for GOP nomination, he has been in a feud with Vander Plotz since the party's interperformance in 2022 midterm elections. Trump is expected to skip the event, marking his second absence from an event hosted by Vander Plotz. Vander Plotz, the faith leader who has endorsed the eventual winner at every GOP caucus since 2008, has not yet said who she will support, but his coveted endorsement may soon go to DeSantis. During a call with fundraisers on Monday, DeSantis told donors he expected an endorsement from Vander Plotz within a week of the roundtable. Multiple participants on the call said. DeSantis' campaign denies the governor said that. In an interview with CBS News, Vander Plotz said the jury is still out on her confirmation and that she was looking forward to the roundtable she will moderate on Friday to help him make his final decision. He added that he would support a candidate between Friday's event and Christmas. Vander Plotz said he wants to support someone with consistent beliefs and a vision of principle. Leadership. But he also wants a candidate who can win not only Iowa caucuses but the nomination and general. Election. He believes Trump has reached a high of 43% in the Des Moines Register poll and predicts. You'll start to see movement away from Trump as the field narrows. This may not happen until December 1st, but I guarantee there will be movement by January 15, he added. Vander Plotz met with the governor of Florida several times, and DeSantis was only candidate to show support for Vander Plotz's event after the Republican National Committee recently threatened to bar any candidates participating in it from debate stage citing a rule against RNC-sanctioned debates. Vander Plotz and the RNC reached an agreement on the event last Saturday. Iowa is ground zero for a lot of reasons. I think if you beat Trump here, it's game on for the nomination. But there's an argument to immediately coalesce around the winner of the Iowa caucuses. Vander Plotz added, That's where unity needs happen. You have to do it one-on-one. -on -one with Trump going New Hampshire, South Carolina or other states. Evangelical Christian voting bloc white evangelical voters have history.